President Bola Tidibu says his administration will continue the fight against corruption without looking back and that the current economic challenges are temporary. The president has stated this during the commissioning of the first phase of the iconic Lagos Rail Mass Transit Red Line project asked Nigerians to pray and work, reassuring that the country will soon get out of the present economic woes. Our correspondent Love Igugu Oyedoku tells us more in this report. The Lagos Rail Mass Transit Red Line runs from Agbado in Ogun State to Oyibo in Lagos mainland local government. The Red Rail Line spans 37 kilometer, boasting 13 stations and integrates major bus terminals at Oyibo, Yaba, Oshodi, Ikeja, Ebutemeta, Iju and Ido with a direct link to the international and domestic wings of the Mortela Mohammed Airport. The official commissioning of the project saw government functionaries, political party supporters, friends, well wishes, waiting patiently to witness yet another epoch-making event. The president was welcomed on arrival by Governor Babajide Sohunlu, his wife, Ibijoke, the Deputy Governor Obafemi Hamzat, State Commissioners, Political Leaders and Aides. In his address, President Chinubu shared insights into the transformative vision for Lagos State. He commended Governor Songulu and the Lagos Metropolitan Area Transport Authority, Lamata, for their commitment and well-guided initiatives. President Chinubu said the rail project shows the validation of dreams and what could happen with the right people in leadership positions. As expected, President Chinubu touched on the present economic challenges and efforts at ensuring that Nigeria is corruption-free. He also went hard on the Nigerian Labour Congress, NLC, for incessant mass protests. The Labour Union... You understand that no matter how much we cling to our freedom and rights, to call for strike within nine months of an administration is unacceptable. If you want to participate, in the electoral process, wait until 20 to 27. If not, maintain peace. They are not the only voice of Nigerians. Earlier in a speech, Governor Sawunlu commended the visionary leadership of President Chinubu for creating the transportation master plan for Lagos State as he thanked former President Goodluck Jonathan for approving the rail track sharing agreement that enabled the commencement of the project. I uniquely was privileged to be part of a new administration that birthed Lamata 20 years ago. On that, you've allowed a seamless movement of people and fuel economic growth and development of our state. I stand here very proud to say that the Lagos State Strategic Transport Master Plan that outlines what those integrated rail systems stood for, which are six rail corridors, one Molo Rail, 14 BRT corridors, and over 20 water routes on vast network of what is today the tiniest, smallest state in our country called Lagos State. Among the distinguished guests at the commissioning were Governors Usman Ododo of Kogi State, Abiodun, Abiodun Oyebanji of Ekiti State, Dakbo Abiodun Ogun, former Lagos State Governor Akinwumi Ambodi, and other notable dignitaries. Love Ikuku Oyedukun, Plus TV News. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.